Hi, I'm Colin from hdcctv.co.uk. This video is about our new PTZ bullet camera that's Wi-Fi or wired. This is the PTZ B4X30. Let's take a closer look. The PTZ B4X30 is an easy to set up and use standalone motorized PTZ camera and recorder. It is 2 megapixel 1080p HD resolution giving a clear image and with its built-in microphone it records audio. It has fully motorized pan and tilt movement, 260 degree pan and 65 degree tilt. Control and view with a smartphone, web browser or network video recorder. It can be used wired or via Wi-Fi, 30 meters of infrared night vision, built-in recorder with 32 gig micro card included and app notification when motion is detected. Now let's take a look at some footage recorded with this camera. Okay, now let's take a look at the mobile app that uses this camera. So the app is called CamHi, C-A-M-H-I. You select it, download and select it, and this is the first screen you see. So we're gonna add the camera. So we plug the power supply into the camera. We plug the short ethernet cable that comes with it between the camera and your router or a network point, and you click add camera. Search camera from LAN is the best option, hit that. It will find the camera, there it is, touch on it to add it, make sure the password and username is, is okay, and then done. That then adds the camera and you can see it there on your camera list. To view the camera, you touch it, touch on it, and that gives you a live view of the camera screen with some buttons around the outside. Now, first of all, the quality there is looking pretty poor. This is because we're looking at the standard definition stream, which is selected using the bottom right button. So you can select SD or HD, let's go to HD, and that should clean that picture up quite nicely. There we go. Okay, so let's have a look what else we've got. We'll start top left. The top left one will give you a mirror and flip button. This is for placing the camera upside down, back to front, so it's always the right way around for you. Next one along is magnifying glass. That brings up the zoom and focus controls. Uh, camera's fully zoomed in at the moment, let me just bring it back. It is an autofocus camera, um, so it will hunt a little while while it's when it's moved to get the best focus and then it'll lock in position. You can use manual controls if you wish, but I've never found that necessary. Okay, there it is, fully zoomed out. Now we can store positions the camera can move obviously it can zoom in and out that sort of thing we can store positions using this third next one along here the preset one setup will save a position call will recall that position now how do we move the camera interesting so what we do is we touch on the screen and slide our finger the direction we want the camera to go so if we want to move the camera left we're going to put our finger on the right side of the screen move it to the left and it will move a short while a short amount Likewise, if you want to go up, slide it up, and it'll go up. Now, once you've got it in the position you want it, touch on the preset button, click Setup to save it, and that will save that position there. Now, along the bottom, we have um, some more buttons. Bottom left is the audio button. This brings up the um, audio coming from the camera's microphone. This model of camera doesn't have a two-way speech, so it's just listen only. The little microphone that's appeared in the bottom right corner is not relevant to this particular camera. Next one along is a snapshot button. This will save a snapshot of the, of the image on, on screen at the moment to the phone's gallery. 
Next one along is a video record button. You'll see a record light top right. This means the camera, the the, the app is now recording this this image to the camera's gallery. Okay, so coming out of the live view, we're back into the setting screen. Now, how do we play back? Along the bottom, we have a few options here. We've got a picture one, which will allow you to show you any snapshots you've taken. So I took a snapshot a few moments ago. There it is. You can email it, delete it, save it as you wish. Video. We go on the video, click on the camera. And here we have all the recordings that are made to the camera's built-in SD card. So when you select one, you have an option to play or download or cancel. So we'll play that one first. And that will then play back the recording. Okay. If you select download, it downloads it to the phone and you can carry on downloading by clicking on the left button here or you can view the download here. So the top item is the one we just downloaded, this out of focus shot here. And we can also not only view it, but if we want to save that somewhere else, we can click on the thing on the right here and that will save it to the phone's own gallery. Okay, that's the app in use. It does also work with the web browser and also our NVR, which will be covered in a separate video. The PTZ B4X30 is available to buy now on our website, hdcctv.co.uk. You can call us on 01952 505 696 or use the blue button in the bottom right corner of our website. Thanks for watching.